क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी इफ द मोनोक्रोमेटिक सोर्स इन यंग्स डबल स्लिट एक्सपेरिमेंट इज रिप्लेस बाय व्हाइट लाइट देन सी मोनोक्रोमेटिक मीन सिंगल वेव लेंथ सो लेट इज एज्यूम इफ यू हैव अ रेड लाइट देन यू विल ऑब्जर्व रेड एंड डार्क फ्रिंजिस राइट इफ यू हैव येलो लाइट यू विल ऑब्जर्व येलो then no fringe means dark then yellow then dark then yellow right so alternate yellow and dark fringe is observed but what if you have white light then if you have white light then when the lights are coming out when the light is coming out from this slit all this light suffers a uh, different diffraction or they bend at different angles they diverge at different angles okay but all the light which reaching at the central point will have same path difference all the light which is coming here they will have same path difference because they travel same distance so their path difference will be zero but suppose a light which is coming from this point which is reaches here and a light coming from this point which is reaches here so their path difference there will be a path difference okay so as there is no path difference between any wavelength at the central point hence there will be a very bright spot okay so there will be a central bright spot but what about the other part so other part will be surrounded by the colored fringes why colored fringes because all the light bends at different angle due to their wavelength right due to their wavelength they bends at different angles so they will produce color fringes according to their wavelength because see if you have that if you remember this equation beta is equals to lambda d by d means the width of the fringe is proportional to lambda means the red uh, the width of the red light red fringe will be more compared to that of the violet hence at the end you will observe red and in at the center you will observe uh, white and in between here you will observe right that is a blue or a violet hence the correct option is there will be a central bright fringe white surrounded by a few colored fringes